<laughs> what is going on guys? Today we got a brand new video with the Mazda 3. Uh, before we get started, just want to let you guys know an update on the uh, fires and everything going around right now. Uh, if you guys didn't watch that, go ahead, watch it. It's a really quick video, just letting you guys know that, you know, we're kind of in a state of I, all eyes on board, like just watching. Um, so, last video I said blah blah blah, this and that. Um, I'll put a map on the screen right now. So, to the left, um, the 32,000 hectare fire that is uh, moving in relatively quick, but not worrying quick at this time. But it is out of control and it's been burning for about a week right now. Um, there is a fire southwest of us as well. I think that's out of control and that's growing too. And then there's just kind of numerous little sparks. Uh, supposedly we're supposed to have or lightning tonight again. You guys will be watching this a couple days later, so who knows? By the time you're watching this, because this will be a scheduled update or a scheduled video, city could be on fire. But here we are, happy mood. So what we're gonna be doing today is, if you guys remember when I took the front bumper off to replace, uh, my GT or to replace my GS bumper with my GT bumper I pulled a lot of ugly wiring out and that included my uh, DRL fog light so I don't have any current fog lights right now as my old ones have an example here as my old one pretty much disintegrated and the wiring went with it too, especially these plugs are broken. So today, what we're gonna be doing is I'm gonna be showing you guys how to install LED fog lights in your Mazda 3. As you guys can see, I still have some stuff in here because I haven't fully unpacked yet because we might have to get ready to go. There's literally ash flying out of my car. So here we have what we're doing today. Some uh, wiring harnesses that I need to plug in because my old ones are pooched. So you don't have to worry about this, but I will show you how I am gonna wire that up anyway. It's already gonna be pre-wired for you guys. Even if you have a base model, it's okay. We're gonna be using some cheap, I believe I got these off of Amazon uh, fog lights. These are 9005s or these are 9006 HB4s. We're gonna be using those. 9005 socks. I think they're 9006 and 9005 for the same thing. Uh, but we're gonna be using those today. So first things first, uh, you guys can do this multiple ways. So you can take the front bumper off or you can get from uh, your fender trays. But we're gonna be taking the front bumper off today because obviously we need to wire. So without further ado, let's do it. Okay guys, so um, if you guys are doing LED fog lights and for some reason you don't have them or if you do, uh, there should be a plug on the end of this. I did something. So you should obviously have a plug right here and literally all you do is just pop it right out of the fog light, unplug it, plug it back in. Uh, but I have to do some wiring, which I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna be doing. So I'm gonna strip back these wires, I'm gonna extend them. Okay, so these ones I actually don't have to extend. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go ahead and strip these back, give it a nice little pull. Make sure these are clean because they have been sitting out for a while. Hey, how are you doing? Good, good. Okay, day? so what's going on here is that because of oh, the way the weather's okay. going, he is calling family who he has so, a text saying that there's thunder uh, and because of the weather, have... it's the reality of so. what's going on here. So I just stripped the wires back here. Here we have uh, the plug. Again, I only have these because I cut. I had to cut off my old ones because they were broken and all my wiring was messed up. So black and red. Black and red. So I'm gonna strip these back too. So we're gonna be soldering these together because they're an outside connection. I've learned this from my previous or previous wire. Generous amount because obviously it gets moist in this area. I'm gonna twist up the wire. And uh, obviously if you have like a wire holder or something to make this a lot easier. So you guys already messed up. Put your heat shrink on first. <laughs> That's the worst. <laughs> At least you didn't like, solder it. I was like, where did it go? <laughs> so we got a starter gun here. We got our solder right here, so we're gonna just put a nice layer on there, make sure it's attached nicely, and then we'll put the heat shrink over it. Uh, if you have flux paste, obviously, you know, I assume you guys know how to wire. There's just like wildfires going on around us right now. We're just here soldering some fog lights. All right, now let's try this multiple times and uh, see which one wants to work. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, I don't know you. Man. There we go. Not a pretty one, but it's good enough. Doesn't pull apart. Slide that right over. Just like so. Hot boy. Yeah, you guys should see my other soldering I did four years ago. No. Do you have a first aid kit here? Okay, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do it to the other side here, and uh, when we're done, I'll show you what's next. So 
Okay guys, so I just plugged the LED in right here. You guys get to see how bright this bad boy is. Take a look. Ready? Ka oh, that's brutal. <laughs> Wait, do it again. I wanna see if we can get the camera to try and focus on it. Yeah, see, it's just like, in real life, it feels like you're getting x-rayed. <laughs> So with that being said guys, since we've done that side, I'm gonna go ahead and do this side. Um, I'm gonna wire it up and then when we're done wiring it up, I'm gonna plug it in so you guys can see and we'll go from there. Obviously, uh, you guys might have different plugs. I'm, I totally forget what the OEM plugs look like, but either way, it's the same situation, okay? This is a 9005 plug and this is a 9006 bulb. It's the same thing, just look for a 9005. HB6, no, this is different and it's also different thingy like this changes with some room. <clears> so <throat> the you gotta make sure look up go to autozone.com make sure what bulb type you have now let's go test them jesus christ <laughs> really okay so now that we've done our wiring and our fog lights we can go ahead and put the front back and the front bumper back on Alright guys, it's the nighttime right now. You guys can see the, the stars above us. Wow. Jeez. Jeez. Those are pretty significant. Crisp, nice light too. It's hard to pick up on camera because the camera won't focus, but they're not focus, but you know what I mean? And a corner like that actually worked. Well guys, that's the video for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. But okay, for real though, small installs, I know, but I also gotta make sure that like stuff doesn't light up around here. So uh, it's nice to be back in the shop for a little bit and uh, gonna be getting into some fun stuff here if, uh, if we don't light on fire. So without further ado, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to hit that subscribe button, leave a like on the video, comment down below. Ring that notification bell, only 1.2 thousand of you guys have. So, if you guys wanna see if I catch on fire, ring the bell. Other than that guys, keep it real. I'll see y'all in the next one.